Yes, you're reading the blog title correctly. I didn't uh, invent it. It's from a video that the Vatican just put out recently. I am not going to go to the video, of course, because, again, like I stated before, I'm not going to get any more copyright strikes uh, or videos deleted by uh, YouTube because of complaints from the uh, Catholic Church. But I, I see no need to comment on the video anyway other than to echo what the brother that sent the video stated. Uh, at 50 seconds in the video, Cardinal Dolan who is the actual Archbishop of New York, says, it's tough to forecast what the future is going to hold. Well, the only reason he says that is because, as we all know, Roman Catholic popes, cardinals, bishops, priests, and nuns do not read Bibles. And so they do not know that Revelation 18 specifically states the forecast for the Catholic Church is, in fact, absolute and utter destruction. And for those that do not believe me when I say they don't read Bibles. See my Sola Scriptura page, wherein I have quotes from them where they literally try to create doctrine that declares the Bible's not to be trusted. And then if that's not enough, see my Words of a Beast page, wherein I have a section listing many quotes from the Vatican and its prelates, where they declare in writing some rather hateful statements towards the Word of God, as well as anyone that reads it, who they proclaim should be destroyed. But the video makes it clear via the title that they believe the bishops of the Roman Catholic Church are to be a model for the world. And so to clarify just what that means, I'm going to share a small list of literally tens of thousands of articles that you can find online that outline the fruits of Roman Catholic bishops so as to illustrate how bad this world would be if in fact Rome was able to convince the people of the world to follow the lead of their bishops dressed in pagan robes. And no, I will not be limiting my findings to U.S. bishops, for as we all know all too well, that whenever a bishop or a cardinal or a priest or a nun are caught committing any type of crime, especially in regards to molesting children, the Pope of the day quickly relocates them to other churches so as to protect them and their so-called moral image. Check out these articles. Now, I could literally go on for hours on this, but I'm going to stop here for now. And now all these links for all these articles and everything are going to be in today's blog entry, as usual. Thank you for watching. God bless.